So, I'm Kevin, and welcome back. Today, we're gonna do the tug of war with two SCX6s. So, I've got mine cranked up. I've got a bunch of mods on mine. Seth's putting his together. Everybody's seen like an X Max take place, but not an SCX6 plus S against SCX6. And I have a bunch of mods. The only mods that, or what, you know, you want to talk about which ones? I don't ones? Really have any mods except for the servo. So, so what I did was I wired my servo directly to the battery so that it's not running off the ESC. What that means is that my steering is much more powerful. That's not really going to help me in a tug of war. But it did save him so for me going through the struggle of finding that you could hardwire your stock one. It saved him. I think I'm in like 400, 500 bucks into two servos. One was 130 and one was 300, so like 450, yeah. So it saved him that, and he had all the power necessary to do all the steering, and I'm super jealous, and all he needed was a direct power plug we got. This thing is all stock, but I do keep it running really, really well. Like, I'm very picky about how it runs. So one thing I did is that the, the steering servo in these, as you can imagine, they never made one of these before, so the steering was kind of weak, because to, to, to price this as it was, they didn't have a servo that was strong enough. So direct wiring it, it steers like crazy. That's really the only mod that I've done. Now Kevin's got the weight advantage. I have the traction advantage, I think, because I haven't worn my tires down as much as Kevin. Uh, and I cut holes in mine. And Kevin... Cut some of the pattern out. He, he, he customizes tread pattern. I trust the engineers, and I have my tread pattern just what it is. So this is big techs. Um, custom license, vanity license plate, keeping it real, toolbox. But underneath, you can kind of see that I have um, changed the full front metal axles from Triel um, and the rear as well. I also put a little skid plate on there. Uh, I also have a bunch of spin up on steering links in the front uh, and a brass weight on the front. Uh, LEDs in there. Um, did some different shock mounting on the bottom. You see that little sneak action there. I kind of doubled up the uh, where I mounted that. I've also plugged the holes in the rims. So I've done a few things, and I think I'm weighing in about two pounds more than Seth. Uh, also, I cut the tires, so I have a little bit more vented. This might not be good on traction-wise as far as on the driveway. He's got the uncut ones. I don't know. I don't know. I think it's going to be so close that it's not really going to make a whole lot of difference. I think I'm going to win. You think you're going to win? You have the weight advantage, but I didn't customize my tread and we're on concrete here. Okay. And I'm also, I'm also really skilled. Okay. We'll see. So we'll see what happens. Should we stay in front of ours? Yeah. Worst case scenario, you pull it out. Okay. <laughs> All right. So what's going to be like the go? I mean, I think we just go slow going. I mean, we don't have to gun it, do we? I mean, no. Well, it's, well, yeah. you do whatever your strategy is to pull the person over the line. Okay. <laughs> you know? <laughs> All right, we we'll just start giving some gas. I mean, oh, wow, just mushing me, huh? I'm just folding on there hard. Well, my tires are also venting, so they're going to have better traction because the phone's going to be over. Yeah, okay. Damn, okay. Because your tires are out of round, so every time... Because when the air comes right. out, the air can't come back in because you plug up the vent holes. Okay. So... I mean, it's pretty obvious that you've got some tra... Ah! Oscar, quit, quit. Just pull it hard. Oscar, quit. Ah. Quit, boy. Oscar. Ooh. Just getting smoked. Oh, oh, I got him now, the momentum. Oh, that's on high too.
Just getting murdered. Oh, now you got the downhill advantage. <laughs> okay, so believe it or not, Seth had just work all the time. His wife has him over here cleaning the car from where Oscar uh, had, a, had a good time in there. But Oscar's in timeout. Oscar's in timeout now. Yeah, he's in the back of the truck. <laughs> oh, yeah, he won't get out of the car. But um, pretty much we found out that uh, Seth's prognosis was that my tires were customized and he's going to have more traction. But he made a valid point on saying that in the crawling situation, it could totally switch up because of the room I have to like get dirt out of the tire and the tread. But until next time, hope you guys enjoyed it. And we'll see you on the next challenge for the XX6 Steady Spin versus Seth. Uh...